Is your condiment game all of these condiments are minimal calorie they are literally like if you have five grams of them which is pretty much what I have on everything they're like seven calories each but the combination of them makes food so much more tasty when you are macronutrient deficient when you are calorically deficient making foods taste nice will help reduce food focus just satisfy you a bit more um, but my, my my favorite thing at the moment is this tomato salsa. It's like salsa verde in the whole thing, the whole tub. There's 90 calories. I've had this for a couple of days now, and it's not even halfway down. So, pro tip: get your condiments sorted. I, I keep them consistent. They're always consistently the same amount, so I never weigh them or anything because I just keep them the same. I literally get look squirt done. As long as they're consistent throughout prep, it's not going to make a difference. Meal two: 50 carb, 40 protein, five fat. It's a beautiful day here today. We are in for push today with the boy. Surprise for you guys, TM Cycles. The boy is back on the channel. Um, I'm gonna keep it nice and raw in the gym for you guys, so you guys can see what we get up to. Um, he has, he has got a videographer down for his member site, which I highly recommend. Which I highly recommend for anyone into bodybuilding, nutrition, steroids, to follow his website. But I'm with the boy today, TM Cycles. It's going to be an amazing session, I'm sure. I'm feeling pretty battered this morning. 45 minutes of cardio has killed me uh, earlier on, but. You know what? It's all part of the journey, so let's go to King's Gym. In the end, she be slanging things like a simian. Always good to be back. Oh boy. Oh boy. Drive! 
Two Josh. Beautiful. Up. There you go. Up, 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 up. Come now. Yes. 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 It's fucking insane. Man. Fucking insane. Perfect. You can see what's what's this bit here. Yeah, I know what you mean about leaning back. Same shit, different day, different gym. Uh, just rounding off that amazing session with the boy with. I'm gonna do about 2,000 steps, so it takes me to about 9, 10,000, which will leave me another one and a half to do later on. I basically break down my steps 2,000 in the morning, 2,000 in the gym, 2,000 after the gym, you know, just constantly hitting two little 2,000s, just so I can hit that, that goal over the, over the day at regular intervals and uh, I really get the benefit of that. I hope you enjoyed the workout. Just a few raw sets for you guys. If you want a, a full detail of the workout, it'll be on the boys' website. Um, otherwise, it's time to go eat. It's time for something that I've been waiting for for weeks. Oh, boys and girls, I think summer's here. It's absolutely fantastic. I, I very much love coming to, uh, coming to Kings and different gyms in London and it gets me very, very excited for the future. Obviously, my future as the moment is uh, my girlfriend and me want to move in together. Um, we've had that discussion. We are going to make that step with each other. Oh my fucking god! Uh, we've told our parents. We've told, we, we've let everyone we know love know that we want to move in together. Um, but she has a mortgage at the moment because she is an independent girl. Oh my god! Um, but she can only get out of it. On, uh, I'm not sure what the terms are. I'm not very good with mortgages. Uh, but she can only get out of it on April 2020, which is next year, obviously. So we're in June, so that's like 10 months. So in 10 months, I'll be living with my queen. And essentially, because she has a fixed job in East London, um, she can't really leave there. She's got amazing career progression and an amazing job as it is, and she is fucking good at it. Um, and, and because I don't have to be anywhere, I'm an online coach, um, it makes sense for me to move in with her. So we're trying to move within 20 to 30 minutes of like Old Street area, East London. So I'll be, I'll be moving to London. So any, if any of you fuckers, any of you guys, not fuckers, are out there in London, you might see me more often. Um, I used to live there for eight months. I left, so I got attacked three times and lived in a shithole. I'm coming back and I'm doing it properly girlfriend in a nice place but we'll keep you we'll keep you informed if you follow the channel we'll keep you informed so there's nothing better than coming back to parcels is there or presents so I bought this yesterday yesterday and it came today which is amazing the new my new camera Canon ATD along with the new video mic pro I've been using I've been using this uh, Sony a6000 with like a 18 to 105 millimeter lens. It's good, but it's like, it's an a6000, so it's like five, 
50 years old. I've had this for about three years. I paid 500 pounds for it. I paid like 60 pounds for the, for the, for the mic. 560 pounds over three years for the amount of content it's given me. I'll take it, it was good quality. Same thing with this. This is an investment for the long term. It's expensive. Should we talk? No. Should I not tell them how much it is? No. You guys you guys are gonna find out how much it is anyway. You got at one moment we spend money, but at the same moment we save money because we buy five kilos of chicken at the same time. Don't let me down. Huh? Comment down below if you've tried them. Let me know what you think. I'm going in. Taste test or taste test? Presents? Hmm? Just got distracted by the presents. <laughs> uh, taste test. It's weird because like, you know how they say like you eat with your eyes as well? My eyes are telling me these are Rice Krispies and they're like snap, crack, and popping. But... Okay. It's not much chocolate. It's not. It's like a squares bar, no? Mm. Not even as strong as that. But I have some with less milk on it, like more rice crispy, less milk. Mm. Quite marshmallowy. They're, they're like milky. Oh, I feel like I've had something like them before. Yeah, they're like marshmallow bars. Like squares bars. Yeah, but just not like... As but well, if you have loads of milk with it, it just tastes like a rice crispy. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Well, that's the climax. Rating out of 10? Normal Cocoa Pops are like 9. And these? 6 and a half. They might grow on me though. I always say try something more than once. Fat metabolizing way. We just fought ages to make the man's thing. Coming from you to hear that that was your reason, I just think. Been I've been deliberating as to what to kind of round this video up with for the last like 30 seconds or so. <laughs> I can't think of anything, so I'm going to leave you with this. Prep is hard, so prepare yourself for it. But just keep going. Because where there's a will, there's a way. Where there's a way, there's a win. So keep working. One more. <laughs> <laughs> One more. <up. laughs>